Hi, I'm Dusty with Flame Innovation. Today we're going to do a follow-up video on the Caboose Tiny Wood Stove. You can mount this stove on the floor or you can mount it on the wall. We're excited to let you know that it's been fully UL tested and approved. So if you want to put it in your little cabin or tiny home, it, it helps with uh, you being able to get insurance. Uh, being that it's a safety approved stove, they put about 30 sensors on this stove, measure all the temperatures, they burn it as hot as they can absolutely get it, uh, they check the glass so that it doesn't break, they pick it up, they drop it, they tip it over, they do everything they can so that you know that you're getting a safety tested stove. It, the, <clears throat> the stove installs with four inch exhaust pipe. We've got class A and we've got single wall for your, for your installs. Clearance for combustibles on the caboose stove per the UL spec sheet. We have 12 inches over here, 16 inches in front of the door. And if you're mounted on the wall kit, you don't have to have anything else on the wall. You've got approximately 18 inches from your wall out to this front edge of the, the shelf bracket. Um, so you know what your distance is there. If you take this stove and you mount it on the floor on an approved hearth pad, you'll have this built-in heat shield here. Your clearance for combustibles are gonna be the same at 12 inches over here, 16 inches here. And if you have a heat shield on your wall with a one inch air gap, so you've got your heat shield, an air gap, and then your wall, so you're not transferring heat right into the wall, you can be within eight inches of, of your wall at that point. The stove is all 3 16 construction, hand welded. We test all of our welds. We light test all of our welds. We've got a lot of stainless steel in this stove. There's stainless steel components inside the stove, stainless steel trim ring. The, the nuts and the bolts and the inserts are stainless steel. You've got an air wash system right here that helps keep your glass clean. You've got a full baffle up top for your exhaust and, and to help with secondary combustion. So the stove is very efficient. Uh, we've got a BTU rating uh, approximately 8,000 to 17,000 BTU. So it's rated for 150, 200 square feet up to six or 700 square feet, depending on how you're insulated in, in your little structure. Um, those burn times are based on uh, like red fir, tamarack, more softwoods. We don't have a lot of hardwood around here. So you probably get a little bit more burn time if you're burning uh, oak or, or a, a different uh, hardwood you know, in the, in the Midwest or back East. Uh, we've got a, a fully adjustable door here as it burns in. Your handle has got notches in it here. So you'll always have a positive ceiling airtight stove. Your main draft is here on the door. And like, once again, this is your air wash control. You've got a secondary heat shield on the back of the stove so that, uh, that gives you clearance for combustibles here. And then also when you mount it on the floor, it helps with your clearance for combustibles there. We're happy to say that we cut all the parts here. We try and get all of the steel uh, from US manufacturers. And we're very proud to build this in Post Falls, Idaho, USA. I'm Dusty with Flame Innovations. Thank you.